Brandon messaged us and he's like, they found me. So he is with security right now. Oh, you're so big. Casey, you're on a cruise ship right now. We walked in and she goes, oh, it's amazing. <laughs> what do you think, bros? Hello and good morning, everyone. <laughs> you guys, you know where we are right now. We are on our... Does it look like we're inside of a boat right now? Does this look at all like the inside of a boat? It is. It looks like the inside of a luxury hotel, but we are floating on the ocean right now in San Juan, Puerto Rico. We just boarded the Freedom of the Seas, I'm Royal so Caribbean. Excited. The kids are freaking out about the elevators, the staircases, the gold trim. It's beautiful. Everything. It feels amazing in here. We haven't eaten in a day and a half though, guys. But you know what? That's really okay. True. We're about to go on a marathon of eating. Everything that you see here, you can eat as much as you want, as many times as you want, any hour of the day that you want. So let's get ready to eat. Whoa. Oh, wow. There's a pullout bed in there, and then me and you in yes, here. Yes, this balcony is cool. Wait, does the balcony go this entire length right here? There's like layout chairs out here on the balcony. Right, guys, how's that? Wait, this is that a, a closet? This is a bigger closet than like Whoa, a normal sweetie. hotel. Whoa, sweetie. It has like a like walk-in closet. <laughs> Holy awesome. Oh my God. <laughs> the bathroom is, it has a tub. No, it does no, not. It has a tub. You kidding? Yeah, it's like a bathroom. 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 Yeah, it's
I told Brandon, like, let me come find you. He's like, I think it's probably best if you don't come find me. I asked them what's happening, and he said, we're looking in rooms with a guy right now. So I think they're looking in rooms to find the drone. I'm thinking, at best, just his drone will be taken away. Michelle's thinking possibly a fine. I don't know, are they going to kick him off the boat? Like, I don't know what's going to happen. Jill? 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 <laughs> We've got the kids here hanging out. I'm actually a little bit nervous. We'll keep you updated, keep you posted on what's going to happen with Dad. As of right now, he and Daniel are with security. Brandon is the official drone operator the official. at the moment. Now bring in security up to our room. So Brexton, let's get off the chair like that. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone act normal, act normal. Shh, no, for real, for real. Okay, everybody just sit down. Hey, I gotta get some shoes on. We're gonna go down to the first floor. If you can bring the, the case of the drone, so. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Is Daniel with you? Yeah, he is. He's right there. Um, Hi, babe. Apparently Brandon tried to land it, but it was going down so he couldn't make our balcony. So he hit a balcony two below us. So we're like, okay, well, let's just check the room number two below us. So we went down two decks, found that room number. Of course, nobody's in their room right now. Right when we're there, a security guy comes up. What? Like, they know exactly they what one. Okay, right so away. right here, kitty corner, there's a bunch of security down there. On the ground. We should have looked there's around There's a ton first. of security. Yeah, they knew right away and people were looking right away. So Brandon just like basically pretty frank, like, oh, my drone was self-landing and I had to land it two floors below my deck so I think it's out on this deck. He was stern at first but then you know Brandon's so likable that they're just <laughs> chatting. It's super nice. He, he got a guy nice. to open the door. So Brandon's looking on his thing. He could see the camera and so we saw him go out to the balcony and pick it up. Look what I have. <laughs> the SD card in the middle. <laughs> this is the SD card. <laughs> I think they're taking it away for sure. Brandon's saying they're gonna take him down to the first floor. <laughs> yeah, what's on the first deck? I know. <laughs> I know. We Except need to find the, out what's on the first the floor. The ship prison. I don't know. Darius, no, like, that's not funny. The ground is on the first I floor. Know, like, <laughs> first floor is underwater, folks. I've got I the. Can't hear you scream under there. Sorry. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> That went crazy. So dad's down there with security. We're gonna update you guys when he comes back. What's gonna happen? But he's hoping that they don't take him off of the boat. Stay tuned. <laughs> You got a remote! Droneless. Droneless. <laughs> so are you gonna get it back? Oh, what, you got what do you remote. have? I have an item, a prohibited item receipt. Oh my god. <laughs> Guys. And I thought my that? kids are gonna be the ones getting arrested on this trip. <laughs> but you're not arrested, you're off the boat. We were just having a conversation if we would still go on the cruise without you if you had to stay here or not. I'm okay, betting you guys done. voted you would still go. I would want you the to The best go. part is Daniel's like, well, for sure we would get off. And I was like, yeah. yeah. I love that you think, thank you. I would hang out in Puerto Rico. You guys can come back and tell me how it was. Riley was like, we would stay and party. For sure. So yeah, drone is gone. They did say I can try and get it back at certain ports. I just have to go check with security, bring my prohibited item receipt. I can get it back to fly like at the beaches and when we snorkel and stuff. And then I just have to give it back to them when I get back on the ship. Oh, that's <laughs> So at the end so of the trip, So when mommy and daddy let me take the home. drone out, they'll let me take the drone out. But B, they said, Daniel said within seconds they were looking for you. Oh, not only was it within seconds, they found us in minutes, like short, short minutes. They found us. And then he radioed in, I found the drone operator, we've got the drone operator. When I just went down to security right now, and there's seven or eight people who were like, that's him, yeah, we've got him. Okay, guys. Oh my god. Code alert is done. Drone well, operator we, has been found. We went out on the balcony and Mindy saw a ton of security guys that were down on the ground. So the second it goes out, and that was probably part of the problem that I launched over where you get on the security side right there. Uh, Second it went out, they went looking. Eh, don't bring drones on cruises. It's not allowed anywhere near the cruise boat. Even when we're at the next port, the cruise is a floating no-fly zone. So you can never fly around a cruise ship. Now we know. Yeah, Feels like I may have said that. that. Who said that? Me! This is what they call the promenade. Now tell me, does this, once again, like we're on a boat, are we on a ship right now? nicer than malls that we have at home. This is like a sick, legit mall, and the best part is, as you walk down through here, ice cream, pizza, restaurants, cupcakes, cupcakes so much stuff that you guys can get, and literally, you guys, you just walk up, you grab it, you go, it's all been taken care of when you're cruising, it's all taken care of. The one we gotta try, though, is that pizza place. Amazing, gotta you guys. Try that. We're doing the mandatory muster station roundup right now, where you gotta go, you gotta get to your station, and figure out where you're gonna be in the event of an emergency, so the kids are gonna round up, and then I think we're gonna get our first dinner, a lot of food themes today. We're gonna get our first dinner tonight at our table. It's gonna be really fun and it's fun because you eat all together so we're assigned with our whole group, nine of us, so it's gonna be really fun every night to regroup, eat dinner, get to know our server. It's gonna be awesome. Guys, are you serious? This is where we're eating every night? This is the coolest seat. Oh my gosh. On cruises, you sit in the same spot every night. Rexy Doodle, can I sit by you? I'm saving it for Michelle. Oh, you save it for Michelle. That's you even better. Can sit right here. 
I'll sit right here. Okay, sit by crew we do. Just off the edge here, you guys. This is our backdrop. Are you kidding me? This is where we're eating every night. Look at the chandelier, the artwork. Oh my goodness. I am loving this, you guys. Crew, are you breaking into the bread already, bud? Yes, but the butter is not here again. I need more butter. The bigger kids went and put stuff back at the room, so I stood right by the entrance. I was the very first one in here. Oh my gosh, are you serious? Yes. They brought us our menus. We have a kids menu for the kids, and you guys, if you want, you can order five of everything. You literally can go down the menu and order all of it, as much as you want of it, as hungry as you get. Creme just eat. Creme brulee. Are you serious, guys? And the menu changes every night, so what we're getting tonight will not yeah. be on the menu tomorrow night, so we always get to choose different oh, things. Spaghetti bolognese. This is the family's first time on a cruise, and I think the kids are just loving the fact that you can order whatever you want, as much as you want. So we're the earlier dining, so we're gonna try and eat right now and then get out as the ship leaves and set sail into the ocean and catch that as well. So we're gonna eat real quick and try and get out there for setting sail. So we had an amazing dinner. Actually, to be honest, people weren't that hungry. Everyone just had one entree, one dessert, and some didn't even get starters. We gotta learn how to cruise a little bit better after this, guys. We need to be eating a little more food. Mindy had read a lot of blog posts gearing up for this cruise. What to bring, what to pack, the secrets, the hacks, the tricks. And one of the things that she read in particular to our ship is to watch the launch. I don't know what you call that. What is that when you like take off? Anyways, when you set sail, that on Freedom of the Seas in particular, they allow you on the helicopter pad. So Brexit Doodle, where are we right now? On the helicopter pad. We found the helicopter pad right now. Now, we're about to set sail now, guys. This is a little different. I have never set sail in the dark before. I've never set sail at night before. It's 8 o'clock p.m. here. We're supposed to leave at 8.30. We're leaving about 30 minutes. And we just found the helicopter pad. So we're going to hang out here. It's kind of a little known secret because most people don't realize you can come out here. And usually you line the top decks of the ship back up there. That's what I've always done in the past. That's what I've done when it's sunny outside. This is supposedly the best place to watch as we sail away because we are on the very front end of the ship. That right there. Where is it? There. That right there is where you do your little Titanic pose. That is the absolute front of the ship. Helicopter pad for the launch coming up in about 30 minutes. Have officially set sail. We are in the ocean, the open ocean right now. And what are we doing? We're getting a slice of pizza, pizza. because we can. They got pizza, so we're getting some. And I think mom wants some ice cream, yes? I want ice cream. Wrapping up our very first day here, and we are now set sail, heading toward Aruba. Tomorrow is an at sea day, but it's even more than that. It's this little lady's birthday tomorrow, you guys. I keep forgetting that. When she wakes up, she's gonna be ancient. Not as ancient as you. <laughs> <laughs> She'll never catch me. Massive happy birthday to this girl. Tomorrow is gonna be a fun full day at sea. We're gonna be celebrating her birthday at sea. We got some fun surprises up our sleeve for her. Plus, we think it's formal night here on the cruise ship, so we're gonna be getting dressed up fancy, having That's a hot. fun dinner. We hope it'd just be too perfect if it was the formal night, be day fun. at sea, mom's birthday. Day. Great first day coming for you tomorrow. Don't miss it. We love you guys. We'll see you. We'll see you guys tomorrow.